Flicko! Hello. Good morning. Good morning. How are you feeling? We're here. This is not some normal beat making shit. This is not a normal Twitch stream. We're not here to game. We're here for some real deal competition today. We're here for the beat battle. Um, Charlie Puth might stop by a little later. Hopefully he can make it to judge. Not sure. Didn't want to promise anything. I might be judging. You guys deserve me as a judge this week. I have a special guest. Charlie Puth is in the fucking building. He made it. We were late. He was on time. Things happen. Puth is in the building. Can I get some love, please? Everything's fixed. The site is fixed. We're back on. You broke the site? Charlie, you broke the site, Charlie. I was four minutes late. Charlie, you have bigger hits in your voice messages and in your fucking memos than I'll ever have in my entire life. Shut you, up. You broke the site, Charlie. Shut the fuck up. Last time Charlie and I were in here, we made the hottest beat ever. I wore my George Michael t-shirt. Ooh, hard. For this. Guys, your beats, we're going to shit on the harmony. If anything's out of tune, it's getting shit on. <laughs> like, patterns, we're creativity. We're so, so picky. The thing about Charlie, he has this sense about, like, he can tell you where your chord change came from in five other songs it's in. Y'all are fucked. We better be on top of it today. You have... How much longer? You have 20 minutes left. Everybody needs to vote. You have 20 minutes left, 20 minutes left. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm taking it back. <gasps> okay, we're ready. We're ready. We're ready. It's time. It's so time. So how does this work? They just it's okay. You. We have a site that was built wow. um, by Eris mm -hmm. and our homie, Mike Gao. Um, basically kids submit a one minute beat based on the sample I gave them. Let me play you the sample so you can hear it. Mm -hmm. And then these are the top uh -huh. 10 voted. So everybody in this chat, whether it's a thousand people in this chat, 20,000 people in this chat, whoever's in here, they all go vote on the top 10. So we're only listening to the top 10. The, the winner gets a don't ever think shit sign. One of two. That's dope. Second place gets eyes top <coughs> ozone nine. Third place gets soothe two, your favorite. I love soothe. Fourth place gets the arouser, which is a distressor plugin. The and arouser. then... <laughs> and fifth place gets Serato Sample. Um, okay, let's go. Top 10, top 10, top 10. Someone's checking if, I, if it is actually one semi -tone. It's okay. <laughs> I don't need smoke. Though. Charlie, I need you. I need your ears. I need your eyes. I need your opinions. Okay, I will give. I, I never. I, I always oh, sugarcoat shit because shit I want people to like me. Okay, don't. We don't want that here. Guys, tell Charlie. Give us the real. Say that. This is the sample. No, Timmy, you're a towel. <laughs> what key is this in, Charlie? G I was actually going to use this sample and I panicked and I gave it to them. I feel like I'm in Quincy Jones' house watching basketball. <laughs> uh, let's go a little further so we know, familiar with what happens. get the general vibe you hear the yeah. textures so that's what they're supposed to use if they don't use enough of it if they only use it for one second if they just loop it you can lose okay. points the chat will let you know if it's boring but um okay first one lark minch let's see what's going on
very strong, very strong, very strong. How do you feel? I like the use of the side chain. I like how it's literally like silent. But like, if you if you slowed that shit down, it would be like one bar of silence. So if you made it like hella slow, like twenty percent, like you, I, I like the use of the side chain. It reminded me of some shit that like Cameron would like rap. Hundred percent. Like Ninety eight though. Hundred percent. Maybe. Is that a good thing? Is that a bad thing? I personally like it a lot. I like it a lot too. We don't. It's not like. We don't judge it on relevancy or like artist friendly oh, necessarily. Okay. It's just general beats because some people come in here and just like make something crazy that no one could ever get on, but that's the best beat flip of the day. No, like for the culture, that's that that's very nostalgic for me. I'm I love it too. I love forward. the drums. It's hitting in here. It's pretty well mixed overall. Um, Lark, you're in first place as of right now. Let's keep that's going. Okay. Um, we have up next. Hold you on. Want smoothies? Uh, I'm good on a smoothie right now. Go ahead. You need one, Charlie. You deserve it. You worked out today. Fifteen dollars is too much for a smoothie. Fifteen dollars? No. Fuck off! I'll starve. No. (laughs) Coco, stop it. Number two. Let's go. Wait, play that. Play it again. Play it. Play it. The beginning. What is that? That little sample. That's the sample. No, like in the very beginning. Ha. On some like ninth wonder tip, Coco, you murdered this. The chop is crazy. The chop is- Repetitive. What do you think, Charlie? What do you think? I like the chop a lot. I like the chop a lot too. I don't think it puts you above Lark. There was a little more creativity going on in his, but yeah, the snare could have been like you could have done something like layered it with like some weird shit. It, like, it is like the it, chop it, is crazy. It definitely has a ninth wonder snare vibe to it. But it was heat. Like I, I feel like you get that beat off first. Honestly, just off the chop. Like I like. What, Dip- was the, what was that sound in the beginning, though? It, it skipped over it when you played it again. It My ears like, don't work like yours. I think it was the... Did you take the sound from... I can't remember. I could be completely fucking wrong, but, like, in the beginning beginning of Girls Just Want to Have Fun, the... Wow, like... I would, I would almost go out on a limb to say I guarantee he didn't use that. I, I don't think it is, but it sounded like it for a, for a second. The, do you know what I mean? The little... Wow. I haven't listened to Cindy Lauper in a long time. I love Cindy Lauper. Battle. The organ sweep, that's what it's called. Is that what that was? So, <laughs> Charlie Eyes. <laughs> Sam Sar, number three. Let's go. First place right now, Lark. Second place, Coco. Stop it. your favorite so far? This is my favorite rhythm. I just wish there was more, more, more well. structure. It's like the chords are all but the fucking rhythm is crazy. Yeah, I think bounce on it is really strong. Some of the bass sounds you had really strong. I liked what you did with the sample, but I agree. There's something that wasn't gelling it for me. And I feel like it could have just been a little, like, wonkier with the sound choice and the swing of it. I feel like if the if the sounds were a little grittier or maybe, like, 
a little more like live feeling. I would I'm just whenever I hear a beat, I'm always thinking like, if I'm not making it, like, if can I like sing over that? I don't know if I could like put a melody over yeah. that. I would definitely fucking listen to that. That would be like on the butter playlist on Spotify. You the know butter I mean? playlist. <laughs> the butter playlist. But that, I mean, that's I have I've never heard just like distortion used like that yet. I mean, it's dope. I just wish there was like a chord, you know, structure. Out of the first three, where do you put it? Uh, I I just fucked with the rhythm so much. I put it at number two. Number two, Sam Sar, number two, Lark, first place, Coco, you're in third place. Let's keep going, Bluff Music. I'll go out on a limb to say very similar and not as well executed as the last one. Mm -hmm. The drums off top felt a little weird in here. Mm -hmm. um, let's keep it moving. What is going on? Drums, I like the, some of the percussion in there, but besides that, the chop felt a little amateur and the reverses felt a little amateur. Guys, we already have such a caliber of beats right now. I'm not going to keep playing through a beat if it's not going to yeah. make the top five. Um, this, is, this is how you get better, though. The amount of fun when I, like, when I used to go into like A&R meetings and play them like trash that I like wanted to pitch to Cody Simpson or something like that. <laughs> I'd like make five trips back to like Boston and like make a better pack and then come yeah. back and be like 5% better. All day. That's how, well, I remember uh, Chasing Cash told me my drums were weak. I used to hit DM him and Hit Boy all the time and he answered and was like, yo, your drums are hella weak, but your ideas are all right. And then I was like, holy shit, but my drums got crazy after that. <laughs> right. I mean... This is how you get better. Come on. Next up. Uh, K&B really no. Jones Bell Bluff Music. All you guys. Shout out to you for submitting. You got the fucking votes. What I say doesn't fucking matter. What Charlie say doesn't fucking matter. Keep going crazy. But low key, whoever made that crazy ass beat, you might need to just chill out a little bit. Um, all right. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Uh, Justin the Dude. It's a little too repetitive. The drums were kind of hard. The patterns were right. But if the drums were super hard, maybe you could get away with how simple the background was. It's not adding up to some of the first ones. I'll speak for Charlie. Um, he has important phone calls. He's coming here actually today for a whole different reason. I asked him if he would listen to the beats at the last minute. So don't get mad if Charlie doesn't hear your fucking beat. Let's keep going. We got shit to do. Come on. Oh, 
Hard. Definitely top five. I'm saying W at the moment. Um, Lark, Coco, Samsara, and Toy Box are in the top four. I don't have a current lineup. I think as Charlie left it, it was Lark first, Samsara second, Coco stop at third. But I think Toy Box is really close to me. I'm going to show him. Don't worry. I'll listen to fucking bluff music again just to... <laughs> Fraser. Hard. Hard. Wait. about it. Mm. Hold on. Bud X Bunny said all the beats are trash. Get the fuck out of here, loser. You ain't even submit because you don't do nothing worthwhile. Um, there's something about that I really like. Is it Frazier? I think it's Frazier Buckley. I think you can't tell if that's a T or F. Um, something cool about that. Last week, somebody who won, I think, uh, their producer name is Swagless Dummy, their real name's Trey, was talking about this thing where you can do groove alignment in Ableton, where if you have, say, like, one hi-hat loop or one drum break or one thing you really like, you can align the groove of everything else in there, including MIDI from other things, including other audio. You can groove align some of your beats together. I think if some of the drums in this were a little more matched up, it would slap really crazy because the percussion all the sounds and the patterns are cool and interesting but it felt like some things were kind of like so swung in different places than other things that they weren't matching up in the right way it had like a little groove issue so maybe fuck with the groove pool um if you want to know how to do that in more in depth swagless dummy put up a video about how um he won the beat battle and talks about that you can groove a line and logic as well um someone just said that too but yeah, maybe Groove Align would help you. But I'm putting you top five, Fraser, for sure. I'll play it for Charlie. But Toy Box, Music, you're up there. Lark, Coco, Stop It, Sam Sara, and Fraser are top five right now. Unless Henry D knocks one out. Let's see. That would hurt Charlie's ears. Um, something sounds wrong. Okay. I think we have our top five for today. I think we have our top five for today. I think we have our top five for today. Let me low-key listen to them one more time really quick. A for effort for everybody, no matter what, every single week, always. Even if you just made a beat today, we didn't get to your beat, you didn't get the most amount of votes. I'm glad you fucking made a beat today. Someone said you mad rude, Kenny. I'm not rude. I could sit in here and say, yo, dope ass beat, man. Love the drums every single fucking week forever, but no one's going to get any fucking better. And honestly, read the chat. You can feel the vibe in the chat. Um, Charlie Poots, an unbelievable musician. This guy has fucking sold hundreds of millions of records. Like, I don't know if that's true. That's a lot of millions of records. Charlie has billions of streams. You know what I'm saying? Like, and he produces his own shit, mixes his own shit. Trust me, if him and I were in here going over our own work, we're going to be very harsh about it and very hard on it. 
Um, make sure that you are getting criticism on your stuff all the time because if people around you are just telling you your shit is dope, it's never going to get any fucking better. A couple of those beats in there weren't it today. It's okay. I didn't say those people aren't it or their production isn't it. Those beats weren't it for this sample or that day. I'm sure they make fire shit. Um, Lark Minch, Coco, Samsara, Toy Box Music, Fraser Buckley. Let's do just one little refresh. One little refresh. Someone said, I'm missing so much fire with this voting system. If you have like better insight on how to do this, please help. Please, I would love, love to hear your thoughts and love to make it even better for everybody. But Eris and Mike have done a great job with this so far. Let's play. Someone said top 20, but you guys got to be realistic. I have a day full of making music. Like, Charlie's not here for Twitch stream. We got shit we got to do. I got shit I got to do with plenty of people all day long. I got a company, I got to run with my friends. We're not doing top 20. This is already a beautiful thing to do top 10 and a fucking art battle. Really love Coco. I love this beat. No matter what anyone says, I really love this personally the most. Man, Sam Sara. Sorry, you're up there. Charlie really did like that one the most. Oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. I'm locked out. Boop, 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 Sorry. Was, someone said that the beat was so bad that you had to fake a call. No! I, I had to... <laughs> I had to... I had to deal with something. All good, all good, all good. Okay, okay. Cole, quick refresh. We, I went through everything... These are the ones you didn't hear. I'll, yeah, I'll play the ones you didn't hear that I liked. Oh. Oh. That was not one of them. Hold on. This one. Fuck. How do I bring it? How do I go to the start? <laughs> that comment is so crazy. <laughs> Hold on, how do I? <laughs> this one's up there. Are you still liking Samsara the best? Play that. Even with the lack of chord structure. Even with the lack of chord structure, it's just like I would I would take that and if, like if I were to take that and like produce that shit like with them, I would like put like chords onto it. So that's just like, but I I I I know I'm not a usual judging suspect. For sure, this. for sure. I'm always come thinking of it from a pop. But you are here today, so we might put that in there. But. Frazier was the other one I really liked. Um. 
let me bring Fraser back. There's some shit with the groove of it, but it's cool. And then this is the one I told him would hurt your ears. Oh my god. Are those notes diatonic? Okay, so we have our top five. Um, Lark, Coco Stop It, Sam Sara, Toy Box Music, and Fraser Buckley. <laughs> Too nostalgic. Did, though. They, did they take the fucking uh, Empire State of Mind? <laughs> It's very possible. I think you put like some RC20 on that or something. <laughs> <laughs> I think I fuck with that. I think we go Samsara first just off of your recommendation. Samsara, we're going to give you the W. Um you are going Actually oh. Yeah, it's too late. I already was halfway through the sentence. Samsara, take the W today just off of Charlie Poot's recommendation. You're getting this don't overthink shit sign. It's one of two. It's unbelievable. Second place, let's go with Toy Box Music. Toy Box Music, you're getting Isotope Ozone 9 Ooh. tonight, immediately. Um, third place, Lark. Lark, you're getting Sooth 2. Wow. Winner. Um, I mean, these are all equally great prizes. I think, I literally said today, I was like, today is a fucking fire gifts. Um, third place, Lark, you are getting Sooth 2. Fourth place... Let's go, Coco, stop it. Coco, your beat was my personal favorite. Coco, let's give you Serato Sample. Mm. Your chops are already good. You don't even need it. Um, fifth place. Oh, no, fourth place is a rouser. Sorry. Fourth place is a rouser from Empirical Labs. Yeah, you're like Steve Harvey. Up in here. It's so much shit I have to remember. Um, Coco, stop it. You're getting the arouser from Empirical Labs, which is fire. Put it on some drums. It's so fire. And then fifth place for Fraser Buckley, Serato Sample. So sick. Okay, um, five people going home with gifts tonight. Get in touch with my mods. They will get you in touch with your gifts. And we are going to send out one of these to Alicia, our biggest gifter tonight. And we're sending out the other one Yo, straight to place, you. Sixth place gets Sony Acid 7. No, no, you can't promise that. Are you going to buy it for them? They're going to, bro, they're going to they're gonna be on me about this for three Yo, weeks now. you get now. a BitTorrent of oh, SoundForge.